Yeah, I think we have a god dog emote, don't we? Should be spamming the god emote. Yeah, my baby. There he is. There's the emote. There he is. The best boy. So now I have a a um bear horn with locking on off features. I really want to see how loud it is. How many times do you get? Is it just one time? Is it a one time use? Don't do it in the house. <laughs> I really want to see what it sounds like. <laughs> like, how do you get one of these and you don't? Don't do it. Do it. Don't do it. Do it. Don't do it. Do it. No, you'll break the seal. Okay. Use short bursts only or the product will not work. Deploy a half second to one second burst for every mile of terrain covered to alert wildlife of your presence. Hold upright, do not tilt, shake, or turn upside down before or during use. Oh, so this is like when you first go on a hike. So like you go to go on your hike and then you just go like, and then all of the wildlife in the area will be like, what the fuck, get out of here. So basically, this is like marking your territory, but with noise. Ah. Ah, I like that. Because I don't know if I told you guys the other day uh, when me and Anaya and Pork were on a walk, there was coyotes following us very closely because of Anaya. But I also take a machete now and I'm fucking ready. So like if a coyote were to come try and attack me, I'd fucking murder that bitch. Unless it was on cocaine, then there's nothing anyone can do. Okay, I'll save it, even though I want to. Dog's gonna lose their shit if you do it. Does the machete give eye frames? <laughs> I wish, right? After this, we're gonna go play with Ivana because she's been waiting for me for quite some time, but my iPhone was broken. This seems dope, whatever this is. Ninja! Hold on. This is a vintage game. Okay, hold on. Fuck. Can be used in many ways as it is probably the only fucking word that can be put in every fucking where and still make fucking sense. <laughs> well, thank you, Anthony, for this awesome gift. Um, guys, so this is a vintage thing. So I don't know, do you guys, do you guys know what this is? It's vintage, apparently. Is this dope? Holy shit, I haven't had one of those in 20 years. You toss ninja stars? No shit. Okay, I think it needs batteries. It doesn't feel like it has batteries, but this is a dope gift. Bro, I have like the best little gift. I have like the best stuff. Like I have so many cool little vintage things now. It's really awesome. Like it's super cool. I feel like this might just be like a stack of eight by tens or something that somebody wants me to sign. But let me, let me see anyway. Oh, I was wrong. Adriana. 
Adriana. Ahem. Adriana. I am impressed by your positivity and ability to simply rock life. I created an unorthodox book and would like for you to have a copy. Please send feedback, even if you think it's shit. Would appreciate any criticism or thoughts. Plus, we'll send a copy of a second book. Aiming for October 2023. Dr. Adams. Alias, thank you for the book. Let's see what it's called. The most unforgettable ER night shift ever. Because genitals suffer injuries. Things get stuck and even orgasms turn nasty. Wow, I like that. This is going to be a fun book. Oh my God. I think this is going to be fun. Oh my God. These two cases dealt with life threatening sexual encounters from which everyone can learn. Number one, make sure to treat your partner's privates with kindness and respect as they may someday save your life. Secondary, when it comes to your own privates, don't act like a dumbass or you may end up with something more serious than numb nuts. 